Hey everyone, usually I record things like this in my kitchen, but today um, it is the end of January and I just really feel the need to just show you this so that you don't miss out on it because it's while supplies last. So I've asked about zucchini noodles and I've asked about riced cauliflower and um, there are plenty of people who are using both especially, <laughs> let's be honest, especially in January and February while people are still gung-ho on their health resolutions, okay? This is while supplies last with Pampered Chef, and so that's why I needed to come on here and show you this so that you can grab it before it's gone. Um, this is our veggie strip maker. So right next to my head, you can see how big it is. Um, there are videos of me using it on my cooking page and probably all over um, YouTube as well. So you can look up videos of that if you if you want to. But I, I needed to talk to you about it so you don't miss out. So if veggie noodles or rice cauliflower is a part of your, your diet, however often it may be, um, I would love for you to consider grabbing this while it's still here. It's only $17, first of all. It's plastic. It cuts both ways. You can see on that end and on that end. So let's pretend, for argument's sake, that this Sharpie is a zucchini, okay? So if you want veggie noodles, and this is your bowl, you will put this on your bowl, and you will lay your zucchini long ways, and it will cut it both ways, and it will make... Um, noodles the size of your zucchini because it's cutting it um, horizontally. If you wanted shredded zucchini for maybe zucchini bread or maybe you want to shred your hash browns for um, potato pancakes or whatever, then you're going to stand your vegetable up like this. And because it cuts both ways, it does it super fast. Um, now let's talk about cauliflower rice. Um, now personally, my tummy does not like cauliflower. I don't know why. Um, and we just don't, we, we eat regular rice in our home. But I have tried it, um, and I have riced an entire head of cauliflower, which is, by the way, cheaper than buying it from the store. Also, when you buy it from the store, you don't really know who shredded it for you. And anyway, I'm not going to get into the, I've seen, never mind. I'll politely say, not really sure what the sanitary situation is when somebody else does it instead of you. Um, but I have shredded an entire head of cauliflower, not shredded, I apologize, riced an entire head of cauliflower in 45 seconds. Yes, I timed it. Um, so you're going to want to stick this into a deep bowl so that you don't get cauliflower confetti all over the place. And it, I mean, it rices your cauliflower in it like a dream, like super fast. So this is a very, very handy tool. It's also pretty flat, so it stores really, really well. And I want to encourage you just to try it out. I mean, I have this in my kitchen. We don't do rice cauliflower, but I um, use this for shredded hard cheeses. I use this to shred my potatoes. Um, I use this to shred my zucchini and my yellow squash. Um, fun tip, if you make latkes... For, uh, you know, the Jewish pancakes, um, peel your potato and then slice them long ways. That's the traditional way of doing it so that the long strands of potato will um, curl up in each other and it will hold your potato pancake together without extra carbs. So uh, traditionally, you shred your potatoes long ways and then you let it sit in a bowl of cold water. I don't know why I'm telling you about latkes all of a sudden. Um, for a while to let the starch settle and then you squeeze out the potatoes from the water and you leave the starch at the bottom and then you you drain out very slowly the water and then you put the starch from the potatoes back in to the mix that way you don't have to use breadcrumbs or um panko breadcrumbs or um sorry or um what is word flour <laughs> words are hard um anyway very, very handy tool. Don't miss it. Don't skip it. Add it to your cart while supplies last only. And I know I've mentioned it before, probably, but if you want to see any other tools, 
even demonstrated, please let me know throughout the party and I would love to go live and show it to you. So let me know and I will talk to you again later.